Welcome back guys, we are here on the BMW stand at the Brussels Motor Show. We are here, we are going to review the uh, all new BMW, BMW M5. Uh, we're going to have a quick look at the outside and inside and uh, show you the maximum things we can show you about this car. So we start with uh, the front. Uh, we have uh, an amazing uh, front looking uh, M5. Uh, we have the two nose, uh, which is really huge, with the M5 logo here. We have the headlights, uh, kind of look really aggressive with those uh, the running lights here. They are really, really aggressive. We have that huge bumper, uh, making it really uh, feel like it, it wants just to hit hit the road and and uh, go fast. Uh, which is pretty insane is also the huge lip uh, underneath uh, it makes it just just look uh, aggressive more aggressive than ever uh, we can also see it has a little cam camera here between the two uh, nose holes here the camera and here the sensor uh, just underneath the number plates Also, uh, an amazing color. Uh, the paint is just incredible. It's a mix between blue, dark, uh, black, green. Uh, it's, it's really, really nice. We have also a pretty huge uh, wheels. We have 20 inches wheel in grey and black, uh, really nice looking, pretty huge, we have that huge brake disc, brake disc and caliper is also huge, really nice to see. Here on the side we have that famous uh, small lens we have, that the uh, old M uh, cars have, here we have the M5. The car itself just looks amazing, really. I mean, in this paint and and tinted windows on the behind, it just looks amazing. We have also this nice carbon roof, just is made to gain some weight on the car, so it doesn't. Uh, so you just gain more horsepower and performance. At the back, we have also a really nice. Uh, back bumper, you see you have on each side two exhaust tips, uh, pretty big ones, and that huge diffuser here in the middle. There are also some nice uh, spoiler lip here on the shrink. It's pretty, pretty nice. Small, but it just gives a aggressive look at the car and it's just amazing. At the back we have also uh, 20 inches wheels and almost as big as in the front brake disc. A uh, really huge brake disc. And even the side mirrors are made to be more efficient uh, in an aerodynamical point of view. Really nice. So let's have a look maybe at the price. It costs 148,000 euros, as shown here. So let's have another look at the interior. 
it should be as nice as the exterior. So here we are in the interior of this incredible M5. So uh, as you can see, just as incredible as the outside of the car, it's just amazing. It smells good, it looks good, it feels good. Uh, have a look at the seats, sports seats with the M5 logo here, uh, it's really nice. Seats are very comfortable, but you feel it's sporty. It uh, it just grabs your back and uh, just push the button start and and all right, you won't move from your seat. Very nice. You have here a really nice steering wheel. Not too small, not too big. Really, really nice. Well made, really like puzzle shifts here behind. You have also some nice button which can configure your uh, your way of driving, put some settings on it. We also have that nice three color stitching on the steering wheel, just as the M logo. Interior is pretty amazing. We have a really nice Bower and Bowers and Wilkins uh, audio system, leather, and overall, you can you have leather here on door panels, on dashboard, on the central unit, on seats, on everywhere. Even the the rooftop is from Alcantara. It's really amazing. It's really soft. Really nice to feel. And the stitching is also amazing. We have the brown stitching, here white stitching. Here we have the seat controls. So here we have also here we have the gorgeous. We have the speedometer. RPM meter, uh, we can display a lot of information on it. You just need to choose uh, what you want to have on those screens. But it's pretty, pretty good. You can change the the way you wanna you wanna see your needles. You just have to go through the options. So here we have this magnificent uh, huge screen which is also a touch screen. You can have infos about your car, everything you need, you have it here. We also have a head display here, which you can configure and change everything you want here. You can change what, what you want to display on it. You can have an M view also, really sporty look. You will have that, that thing here, just here above. Here we can also change the cluster. As I said, we can configure it. So as you look, you can change it the way you want it. It's really, really nice. We have also navigation, which should be 
as good as it looks. Yeah, it's smooth, fast, pretty clear, really nice. You also have that small screen here uh, for climate controls, uh, heated seats here, you can set everything you want here. And here also. Really nice. In the middle we have the, the shift knob here uh, to change to change gears. It's really nice. Feels feels comfortable. You can grab it easily uh, and also change it easily. Speed really really nice one. Here we have some some setups. Uh, you can choose your driving preference you can put efficient sport or sportless you can change suspension you can have it also comfort sport or sportless and the last one is steering wheel how you want to feel it in comfort way sport way or sport plus and you just have to choose choose it we have also here a nice button which is made to uh, make the car loudier to have more do more uh, to, f to hear more the exhaust notes so the dashboard is pretty pretty impressive you have that this this really good black part here the leather over here um, and leather down here the brown with white stitching is just amazing just makes the, the, the car look really classy really really comfortable we also have a lot of pieces where you can put your stuff really really great so here at the back we have also a uh, really nice really nice interior you feel it you have plenty of space uh, got a seat in it. Even though I'm pretty big, you see, you can have enough enough space for uh, my legs. I just you have also here yeah, all climate controls as usual in BMWs. It's really, really nice. trunk should be also pretty big all electric and you see it's pretty big you have plenty of space to put your stuff in it and just go for a ride with your family very nice thanks for watching this was for the uh, BMW M5 and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see a lot of new stuff thanks